Welcome to the Recon Trader. In today's video, I will show you how to set up a Bybit spot grid trading bot. And in fact, right now, Bybit is offering zero fees on all of their trading bots. So you can deploy a spot trading bot and pay essentially zero fees when the bot is executing trades. So for instance, on a grid bot, every time it buys or sells, you will pay zero fees instead of the traditional buy and sell fee. So with that all being said, let's get to it. Now, if you don't already have a Bybit account, I will drop a link in the description down below and you can click on that link and sign up for a new Bybit account, which will then get you access to the zero fee spot trading that they're currently offering. As you can see up here at the top of the screen, 0% fee spot trading or even over here under spot zero fees. So once you sign up for your account through that link in the description down below, you will be eligible for zero spot trading fees at least for the near future they keep extending it so i don't know when it will actually expire or if they will ever go back to charging for spot trading fees now once you have joined bybit and you've signed into your account you want to make sure you have some funds available over in your spot account in this case you can see i have a little bit of funds available for deploying this grid bot if you don't simply click on deposit Select the coin you want to deposit, more than likely USDT. Select the chain type. If you're sending it from uh, Binance, then you would send it from BEP20. ERC20 would be the Ethereum chain, and that will cost you a hefty fee. Or you could do TRC20. That's typically the chain that I use, which would be the Tron. Now that you have the coin and the chain selected, click Acknowledge. It will give you your wallet address. Then you can simply copy this wallet address and paste it into whatever wallet you're going to be sending funds from so that they will arrive over here at Bybit. And once the funds arrive, you're ready to deploy one of these free trading bots. And to do so, you come over here to the tab that says trade, scroll down to trading bot, give that a click, and you will arrive over here at the Bybit trading bot page. From here, you can select what type of bot you want to deploy. Currently, they really only have two bots. It's a spot grid bot and a DCA bot. Today, we will be deploying the spot grid bot. And as you can see, zero fees. And out of curiosity, we can view one of my bots that's already up and running and has been running for just about four months now. So over the four month period, not a huge return. However, in a bearish market, I'll take any positive number I can get. But if I click on details, you can see the trading fees I've been paying on all of these buy and sell orders is zero. I have not had to pay any trading fees for quite some time now. So with that in mind, let's get one of these spot grid bots deployed. So you just come over here to create now, give that a click. Next, you need to select what pair you actually want to trade. And today I will be deploying a bot on ETH USDT. So you will need to search down through the list of different coins. You can see there is a wide variety of coins you can actually trade. But all the way down here at the bottom is ETH USDT. Give that a click. Next, I need to select my lower price and upper price. And for those of you who are not familiar with how a grid bot works, basically you have a lower price limit and an upper price limit. And then you end up with limit orders. The red lines would represent limit sell orders and the green lines would represent open limit buy orders that basically fall within your lower and upper limit range. And the ideal price action you're looking for is price that is actually consolidating in between your upper and lower range. And thus it would give you an opportunity to basically buy low and sell high multiple times throughout this time frame and locking in profit each time that the bot sells high after buying low. And so right now on the four hour chart for Ethereum, you can see that the price action is somewhat consolidating sideways. I typically prefer it to be somewhat trending up 
However, right now, ETH is actually kind of trending down. If we draw in a trend line, you can see ETH is setting lower highs on the way down. But I am willing to hold ETH long term, so I'm willing to deploy a grid bot on ETH in the hopes that I can buy ETH at a lower price. And eventually, when the market turns a little more bullish, perhaps sell that ETH for a profit. And so it looks like right now ETH is essentially consolidating and trading sideways between 1400 and a lower level of around 1200. So if we jump back over here to Bybit, I could set up my lower price at 1200 and my upper price at 1400. I would then need to select the number of grids, those open limit orders, and I can select anywhere between two and 28 given my price range now if i was to raise this to 1500 you can see that the number of grids have increased i can now go up to 40. but if we bump that back down to 1400 and let's say i go with 20 grids that would give me an interval of 10 usdt per grid with a profit per grid of 0.71 percent to 0.83 percent and again there's no fees, so I don't have to worry about the fees coming out of my profit. Next, I need to determine how much ammo I want to actually give this bot to go to battle with. And you can see that my minimum amount is $74.91. And as you can see, I have about $2,400 available to give this bot. So let's go ahead and give it $250. Now, before we get into the advanced settings, there is the option if you're not comfortable in selecting your lower and upper range, you can just click on auto fill right here. And that will fill in the actual lower and upper range for you. And as you can see that the algorithm actually selected 1190 and 1409, almost exactly the numbers I had. I had 1200 and 1400. And then I had the number of grids at 20 and the algorithm set it at 30. And since the adjustment is just below 1200, which is not a bad idea to be right below a round number like 1200, and on the flip side, 1400 is just above it, that gives the bot a little more room to maneuver if the price actually comes right into those even numbers. So I'm okay with that. Now, the profit per grid is only 0.52% to 0.61%. I'd prefer to see that a little higher. So let's go back to my 20 number and that gives my profit per grid 0.78 to 0.92 and that is where I prefer to have most of my grids set up at least right now in the bear market is around 1% and that gets us pretty close. Now we can take a look at the advanced settings. They're optional. I can select my entry price if I want to wait for the price of ETH to get to a certain price before I deploy the bot. Right now it's at 12.94 which does kind of lie right in the middle of my upper and lower range. And I don't mind actually deploying a bot right in the middle of the range. It has room to go down and buy more of the asset. Or if the price starts to go up from here, I'm selling for profit right away. The price being right in the middle of this grid, either direction is going to work for me. I buy more at a lower price or I sell what I currently buy right now at a higher price. So I won't be setting up an entry price. Now stop price, if you're trading something you're not willing to hold long term, you definitely want to have a stop price where you want to shut it down and take your losses. ETH is something I'm willing to hold long term, so I'm not going to have a stop loss in place. And then take profit. Again, I'm looking to hold ETH long term. However, if the price of ETH was to recover to say 1600 or higher, the bot would really be way out of range and no longer in the fight. So I might as well take my profit off the board and then perhaps take a look at maybe deploying a new bot with a new range and so you could set a take profit range at say 1600 and at that point the bot would shut down however i manually manage most of my bots so i won't be setting up a take profit or the stop loss and again i don't need the entry price these advanced settings as you can see are optional now to quickly recap, my pair is ETH USDT. My price range, the lower limit is 1190. The upper limit is 1409. The number of grids is 20 grids. My interval is just about $11 per grid. And then my profit per grid will run around 0.78% to 0.92%. So just under 1%. My total investment will be 250 USDT. And now I'm ready to click create now. 
and then I get this confirmation of all those settings and it's important to note that 0.10142 ETH will be bought at market price as soon as I click confirm in order to go ahead and fulfill these sell orders on the way up if the price of ETH does nothing but go straight up from deployment, I need to have some ETH on hand in order to fulfill these open limit sell orders on the way up towards my upper limit. So I'm good with that. So I click confirm. And now you can see the new active grid bot has been deployed for less than a minute, basically. And the pair is ETH USDT. And the grid range or the price range is on the lower level, 1190. And on the upper limit is 1409. And then I have a total of 20 grids. If I click on details, I can see the current status. If I click on position, it will show the amount of ETH that I currently hold in order to fulfill these open limit sell orders over here. And then I still have some USDT available to fulfill the open limit buy orders. So I think that pretty much wraps it up. I will do an update video in the future on how this bot is performing and if Bybit is still offering those zero fees. So now would be a good time to shoot that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future videos. If you like this video, do me a favor, spike a like. If you have questions, comments, drop them in the comment section down below. I will drop a link to Bybit in the description down below. And until next time, remember, never send your money into battle without first doing your recon. See you in the next video.